All right, you guys, I'm back again. I'm going to be making a men soap called a uh, cashmere crown. So it's going to be a little blue and a little artesana premium gold. gold. And then a little cream. So we're going to have our base color as cream at the bottom layer. We're going to probably have our blue in the middle and then our gold crown, of course, at the top. And um, I think I'm going to just sprinkle it with a little hieroglyphic, hieroglyphic glitter. <laughs> and the uh, fragrance I'll be using is from, of course, Crafter's Choice Black Cashmere. Okay, let's get started. So my um, base recipe is always the same. For my regular baseline of soaps, is 10 ounce olive oil, 10 ounce coconut oil, and 10 ounce sunflower oil. We make sure we have that all in our container mixed. And then we get our sodium hydroxide solution. We pour that in and give it a Stick blend until it is Once again, this recipe is for a 42 ounce loaf mold. <laughs> base color nice base color we're gonna have this getting thick we're gonna let this thicken up on the side while we mix up our other colors Put our Aztec gold from Artesna and the rest of our batch to get it a nice gold. So we're going to start with our blue. And this is ice blue and bright blue from Arteza mixed together. So we're just going to slowly mix this in. Then I'm going to get the blend stick blender and get it all together. The colors will light it up, of course, as it cures. So I'm going to make it a little bit darker. That way it won't be too light. So I'm going to go get some space green. I'm going to some space blue. Be right back. Get a little space blue. Teaser blue. Mm -hmm. and a little of our bright blue. Mix it in. 
And we're going to get our stick blender and mix it all the way in. Just mix good. I have a nice gold for the top. I'll go ahead and pour in our blue. Let's see, it's right there. Try pouring the blue. there for the top. Scrape all the solids with all that soap. So we have nice bars. I'm just going to pour it. And I'll use the spatula to let it stay on top. I'm going to pat it down a little bit. Hmm. I'll just put a little blue. I'm not going to do nothing too special with the blue at the top. I'll probably get a spoon and texture the top so I can have a little indents at you know like a crown because the crown have spikes so just drizzle a little color of that icing bright blue and i'm gonna get a spoon so i'm going to just texture the top with a spoon put a little couple of indents not hard enough. Probably need to let it sit for a minute. And then indent. 
While I wait a little bit, I'm gonna find my holographic letter. So if I'm unable to indent this properly, I'm just going to brush with a little Atomic Tech. Uh, I have bronze Atomic Tech and I have gloss blue. Just sprinkle it over the top. I think it actually came out pretty nice. There probably should be enough of that. And this is what the bar looks like. And this is our cashmere crown. We have cream at the bottom, little ice blue in the middle, and of course a golden crown up top, and a little blue gem swirl at the top with bronze and gloss blue sprinkles at the top. So we're going to come back in 18 to 24 hours and cut and see what it looks like. Thank you guys for watching.